Although Andrew was the most destructive hurricane, another hurricane, this one called Mitch, tore through Central America. It struck on October 24, 1998, killing 11,000 people in nine countries, making it the deadliest hurricane to strike the Western Hemisphere in modern times. In a matter of hours, rivers from the Yucatan Peninsula to the Panama Canal swelled to three times their normal size. Floodwaters destroyed houses and even swept people out to sea. The rains caused massive mudslides and landslides. Sustained winds of up to 180 miles an hour decimated the countryside. In the aftermath, Hurricane Mitch left the developing countries to face hunger, disease, and the task of burying the dead. Bodies were dragged from the floodwaters. Sanitary workers disposed of cadavers. Crowds watched in horror as the morbid work continued. Despite the visits of former presidents Bush and Carter and an international relief effort, Central America is still dealing with the devastating legacy of Hurricane Mitch, the deadliest hurricane in the Western Hemisphere.